Hello, this is Beta Ray Ben for Pixel Spank, and today I'm playing Gravitators, which I don't know too much about it, but I know the developer sent me an email with a code in the email, which which I'm always for. Uh, okay, fighter training, good training, something. Yeah, I I think I can do this. Complete, yeah, it's fine. Abort is circle, start is options. For some reason, this seems to think I'm using a PS4 controller. And the the options is that button. On a, yeah, okay. All right, so it's pretty, pretty straightforward controls. Um, a mix between a twin stick shooter and uh, asteroids, I would say. If if this has got a thing where you uh what was that a missile? I was supposed to shoot that. Oh I think I shoot do I shoot this and I get more? Or do I have to run into it to get more? Shit. Oh I've just read bottom left, it's on a cooldown. It's actually very hard to aim at. Let's get real close. Let's cheat. Yeah. So when I when I loaded this up, it asked me to pick between modern controls and like non-modern controls. And the, it, the, apparently the non-modern controls, it was something like every ship has like a like a different control scheme. And I, I went for modern where every skip ship uses this control scheme, which is move of one stick and not the other. I'm either I'm bad you know what I think it is? It's not that I'm bad at aiming, it's because there's gravity and it ba you're basically always moving. It just makes it that little bit harder to control. Tever Tever Oh, oh, it's like Lunar Lander. That is, it's like a huge number of old arcade games I, I, I used to play. The, for some reason, the one that comes most to mind is Desert Storm, which I think was isometric, but also Lunar Lander, which was like a flash game, I think, that you used to play in school because it was vaguely educational. X to next mission, All right? I think I could have worked out everything there. More training tips. I'm just gonna. My controller is no longer working, so. Hopefully that will come back. Yep, it has. Oh, it's a different ship. It controls the same, though. Oh, it's got, oh, I see. I, Sparker's main weapon can sh shoot overheat. Stop shooting, its rays change colour. I mean, this ship already seems significantly better than, than the previous one. For one, look at that aiming arc. I'm not going to have to worry about that at all. Christ! Oh my god, can you get me the hell out of it, please? I've done it all already. Once the checkpoint port is at it, you'll re all right, fine. Yeah, pick this. Oh, it's a button. Uh, I see. There was a bar going off. Um, I understand. This is fine. Do you know what's weird, right? It's a, it's a, you think it's a top down perspective, but it's not. It's side scrolling because gravity is pushing you down. So, which is, is, is the opposite of what you think. I was fine. I was never in any real danger. Oh, look, a man. Let's save him. Human engineer. Uh, 
Alright, now it's just it's telling me to push the E kit. That, I haven't... It, it, it's just jumping between keyboard and mouse controls, con, PS4 controller for some reason. How is there a conveyor belt? I, 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 I presume I can fly, but that was for some reason a 2D puzzle on a on a 3D plane. Yes, land. Doesn't seem like it's too harsh on the landings. I'm thinking outside of this training, there's going to be damage for running into walls, and I'm going to immediately destroy myself because of it. Okay, we're in a mission. Ship selection. Wow. That is a lot of ships, possibly. Oh, okay. A fighter or a sparker. Uh, I'm going to go with the sparker. It seemed much better. And I didn't change the loadout or the difficulty, so this should be fine. Yeah. Are these enemies? Maybe. Ooh, I, ne I nearly smashed straight into that, didn't I? This ship is great. I've already, I've already decided it. It's, it's brilliant. What is that? Power up? Feels like a power up. Damage amplifier. Oh, that's the route to get. Oh, shit. I'm taking quite a bit of damage already. Let's absorb energy from this. This is a thing. Alright, here we go. I assume I can't hit myself with that. Oh, it, it looked like I almost planned that, didn't it? Let's fire another one off just to, just to run in. Oh, I'm near death. I've I've been going too harsh. So I I think I've taken all of the damage I've taken from ramming into shit, which is very on brand. I'm thinking those four crystals. I probably use like half of the total juice that thing can give. Can I go through that? No, probably not. But maybe. It's a little bit tricky to tell what's scenery and what isn't. Oh, you can run out of juice entirely. I bet that means it's like you've run out of ammo. Seems an odd choice. Wait, that was a checkpoint. And for some reason you have to activate it without just flying through it like every other game in existence. So it's actually a save point is what it is. That might have been a bit much. It didn't even kill the fucker. It did the good, the good so. Is that power up? Give me the power up. Main ammo upgrade. I don't know what that means. Um. Oh, I, yeah, I, I now know what that means. All right, let's go back and deal with this now. Checkpoint there, tether that. Get my juice back here. My power's not at full though, I don't know what that means. It's probably some hitherto unknown ability I haven't been using. Oh wait, I just, oh, that's like a Megatron head. I've now realized those star things only shoot in the directions there the stars go. All enemies are destroyed, good job. We're now, we're coming down now. Oh. Um, am I supposed to? Sure. The graphics of this game are are quite bad. No, the the art style of this game is is quite bad. But I got awards, so some good come from it. I was hoping this would be more of a, what's it called? Uh, that one, you know, Geometry Wars style affair. Right, let's affect loadout. Oh, I was pushing the wrong button. Yeah, when I kept saying there were loads of ships, that's loads of loadouts. All collision damage is reduced by 50%. I need that. Should we try the fighter this time? I'll live to regret this, I'm sure. I will skip all information on the mission. I will just... Jump straight in. Collision armor, go. 
Christ. You can't see a whole lot, can you? Is that a road? Yeah. I already regret this decision. It's very hard to hit anything with this with this ship. Great, now use the battery to open the door ahead. Let's get it swinging. Oh, Christ. Not too much. Oh, I don't have to hold circle. That makes life a little bit easier. I've been holding it this whole time. I just realized, this, this, this vehicle is crap. It's got shitty little gun, worse missile, and then big missile, which admittedly is good, but not great. It's, it's this missile that lets it down. It should be a homing missile. Ion ammo. I don't know. There's no way of knowing. Ah, oh, I blew up the health thing. This is a ship. There is a shielder below. So the text on this is so goddamn small. I can't see a, a flipping thing. Yeah, I got him. Ion ammo apparently helped. Who knows? You know what? I reckon there was something back here I missed. Felt like I didn't explore this area quite right. Low fuel warning. Well, oh, that's what it is. It's fuel. Okay. Well, that's a horrifying realization. Let's hope the fuel only lasts while in free fall. And I'm gonna, I'm about to reenact, uh, what's it called, the end of Dunkirk right here, where I'm just, I'm gonna be coasting as much as possible down this area. Oh my god, that's a checkpoint. Am I gonna respawn though with no fuel? I'm almost tempted to kill myself just to find out. I'm not, but it's tempting. I feel like sci-fi games feel obligated to, like, give themselves a nonsense story, don't they? Like, this is called Gravitators, where there's probably something going on, I don't know. We feel, I feel like we're kind of the bad guys, because I've clearly invaded this city. Uh, oh, that's what it was. Extra armor. And invincibility cloak. And also this thing. I've stolen this artifact. Hang on. Collision. Oh, I see. You can have one or the other. I don't know. I guess I've, I think I've landed on the cloak and I've ditched my collision armor. We got a bit of a bit of a jackknife situation going on. I think a tail slapper might be the technical term. Okay, I have been hacked. Oh, okay, right. That was lucky. I nearly just flew straight past that because I didn't know what to do with it. Oh, big mutant fish. Okay, seemed fair. It's weird. Why did that one enemy up there respawn? Alright, big mutant fish. I don't really know how I fucked that up last time, to be honest. I just... I kind of got too close, I guess. Some enemies just go with the generator. How about... How are you? More will come soon. This, a, this doesn't affect my fuel shooting. I think on this ship you can just shoot indefinitely. On the sparky one it will overheat, but this one's alright. And I've got three of those 
big missiles. And kind of infinite of the little ones. They just, it's on a timer. I, I'm starting to get this now. The other ship is infinitely better though. Oh yeah. I remember how to get through things. So slightly destructive environments. Protect the generators. The shield ability I am completely forgetting about constantly. I suppose the f the benefit of the fighter here is is the uh, longevity of it. I don't know if I can do damage to the generators or not. My assumption is I can. Okay, this has now become boring. This is very rep repetitive. The what? Well, they're they're most mostly all right. Which way do I go, right or left? It doesn't matter. The minimap tells me it doesn't matter. Well, I'll just refuel before I go in. Why not? Do I actually have to land? No. Get near it, press circle. This game's just not very exciting, you know? It's, it's very much just, yeah, you know, going through the motions. I'm hoping, I feel like we're now at the point where there should be just a, li a little more. Asteroid belt, enemy base, right, that's, um, I thought maybe it would have unlocked different stuff, but it hasn't, oh well. I'll take the sparker, obviously, and uh, hints, objectives, awards, perks, all locked. How big is this game that it's got this many unlockables? to it and I'm yet to see any of them. Oh, am I, am I supposed to be defending? Escort nuke to target location. We're in space now. Okay, I think this is a go ahead sort of a situation. Yep, I may have messed up there. I'm I'm just clattering all over the shop here. It's a strategy. Can I destroy that, or is it just going to infinitely spawn ships? I don't know. Let's come on. We got we got to keep going. I should be shielding more, shouldn't I? I'm not doing that enough. Did that do me damage, then? I don't think so. Is that finished spawning? Yeah. Oh, I've got to open the way. And I'm dead. It's fine. Now, what do I respawn with? Full health. Give me that. What is it? Main ammo upgrade. Sweet. See, why didn't I get any of these last time? I, I'm genuinely interested to know what it even does to... To, like, the, the other... Thing. What's this? Oh, it's like a mini health station. Useful. But I'm on no time constraint. I should go to full health. I don't know why it takes so long. It's just a, a ball lake. Fuck. I keep bumping into shit. It's, see, anything doing me damage is that I bump into shit constantly. Yeah, fuck you, you little bastards. The rake of death. It's a bit like a rake in my mind. All right. All right. Have they finished spawning yet? Have they spawn forever. Interact with the newt so it continues. Oh, for fuck's sake! You didn't tell me I had to do that. Wait, can I just tell it to stop at any time? I presume if it gets near to this thing, it'll be all right. I don't know. I'll leave it for now. I'm sure it will be fine in there. Weird windmill thing. Why is it there? Who knows? Oh, my hole's fucked. And I'm dead. Oh, God, this is tiresome. Oh, I lost my upgraded ammo. That seemed fair. Off. 
Okay, yeah, you do you do still take damage when you're shielded. Just it just adds a, another little bit of pointlessness to the shield. Am I doing anything? I don't feel like I am. Oh, I had to take it out, obviously. I can do both at once. Oddly pleasing. I'm going to assume this thing on KN doesn't take damage. The beams, I feel like, will do it a mischief. But beyond that, I'm not too worried. This is what's weird. It doesn't make sense. that They've got like the, the inertial flying system. The, the downward gravity always on. But you can turn. But it has no effect. Because you can go in any direction anyway. It's like you're a, a completely 3D mobile vessel with a turret on it. Which is fine, but... Come on. Along you come. Power up. Give me the power up. Invincibility cloak. How does it work? Am I invincible? Is that moving? I did tell you to move, and you didn't. Uh... I was going to take that out of there to power this one, but I don't think it works. Oh, it's just one in it. I knew. I knew all along. One day I'll do something cool with that reflective ability. I don't know when. I just I feel it's inevitable. I may have been overkill for that one enemy. I'm bored. I'm at, I'm genuine. I'm just going to stop. This is just a boring game. It's not bad. It's just it's just dull. Um, thanks, Presco sent me this. Uh, it's not. It's just boring. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.